Hey guys, Blood Right here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to this episode of The Wine Cellar on PlayStation 1 Longboxes. This is ESPN, ESPN 2 Extreme Games. Um, this game predates uh, Tony Hawk. Um, and this is probably, I think, one of the first longboxes that I started um, getting when I got the, started doing the collection. Um, and just the back box says Insane Sports for an Extreme Generation. Um, this game is easily fine. You can find this online for super cheap. It's not one of the um, ex expensive. Yeah, it's weird. It says ESPN, but then on the cover it shows ESPN too. Um, yeah, this one uh, the jewel case could be replaced, um, but you know everything else is in in great condition. I press start, but it's not doing anything. Oh my god, the loading is so bad. <laughs> Yikes, okay. Turn that music down just a tad. Oh, there's the ESPN2 over there. On. Uh, we're going to do one player ex exhibition, continue se new season. All right, well, we're just going to do exhibition because <laughs> I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Player one selection, course selection, press start to race. like each one a different sport oh, God. is it all skateboarding oh, okay. it's a lot of people to choose from here Because I honestly had no idea what the hell's going on. Alright, so we're in Utah. Hardcore features of this game include a charge six different bonsai courses covering San Francisco to the money level. <laughs> Four extreme levels of difficulty, two player split screen, On your mark. all that fun Get stuff. Set. Go. I just gotta hold X. guy racing us that's doing the luge. Okay. That seems fair. And you can bump. I'm in last place and for damn good reason. Again, no idea what the hell I'm doing. Yeah, am 
I go from zero to 20 miles an hour pretty damn fast. <laughs> That guy could just go straight through it. Okay. Can I just kill a bunny? Anybody can do this and do it first, and I'm on medium difficulty. I can't even imagine what the harder difficulties are like. Press every button I can to try to get some speed and not getting anything. Back once you pass a certain part of them, okay. God, it's so dangerous to like punch some dude while he's on a bike. Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, absolutely horrible. I somehow scored 23,000 points. Loading screen will force you to freaking. Oh god. Um. And I somehow have the high score now in Utah. <laughs> All right then. Assuming the character that you choose is what gives them their well, let's go over to the skateboarder, I guess. And we're heading to Lake Tahoe. <laughs> God, escape, man. Um, definitely tried to cash in on the people that, um, you know, yeah, this came out in 95. Um, X Games, I can't remember if they had started yet, but must have to for this game on to come out. Mark. Get set, go! Okay, so I'm in rollerblades again. Hay barrels there. Oh my god. All I hear is just people like beating the crap out of each other. 
That's why we tune into ESPN, right? Watch, watch people beat the crap out of each other. I mean, an exhibition is probably going through it. Probably doesn't matter. can't tell if that's like the break or if that's the triangle does like come to a complete stop. I don't know. This game is so weird. or better equipment. It's just a bragging rights thing. I, oh, there's a big pile of rocks there. Man, and I was doing so well. I was in ninth place. And you run into one object and you're back in last. That's kind of funny. Let's see how you knock down a guy who's already laying down. Ask four people and yet I only move up two ranks. And there it is, guys. <laughs> same game like on every single map just you know obviously a different course so it is what it is well guys that is espn espn 2 extreme games uh yeah that, this game was not fun um, i would much rather just pop in the original tony hawk at this point but thank you guys so much for tuning in we will see you guys on the next one stay grooving Hey guys, thank you so much for checking out this episode of the Wine Cellar Project on PS1 Long Bacchus. Be sure to check out the rest of our channel for more of the Wine Cellar Project.